Hello everyone. My name is Samir Singh. I am a technical marketing engineer in Cisco. In this demo, we will look at how we can migrate a Palo Alto network firewall to a Cisco Secure Firewall Threat Defense Firewall using the firewall migration tool. We log into the tool and select the source firewall vendor as Palo Alto Networks. Upload the source configuration exported from the device and the tool displays the different components that are available for migration. Next, provide the address of the target firewall management center. The tool connects to the device and provides a list of the different FTD devices that are registered to it. Select the target FTD and proceed. The tool then displays the different features that are available for migration for users to make a choice. Rules with services as application default are migrated on FTD with services as any and user has the option to migrate these as enabled or disabled rules. Proceed with the parsing and once complete, the tool displays a summary of the different components that will be migrated and provides a detailed pre-migration report. The pre-migration report contains a summary of the different features that will be migrated, lines with errors, unsupported configuration, partially supported, as well as ignored configuration. Next, we map the interfaces from the source configuration to interfaces that are available on the target instances. Following this, we map zones that are present in the source configuration with security zones on the target FTD. We have the option to auto create these zones by the tool. Next, we can map applications present in the source configuration rules with target applications. Blank mapping contains source applications that need to be mapped with an application or port on the target device by the user. Although recommended to map all applications, it is not mandatory and the migration can still be completed. By default, all the predefined mappings are listed in the valid mappings tab. Predefined mappings are done by the tool based on a database that it maintains. Invalid mappings tab contain list of applications for which mapping mode is selected, but no target is provided by the user or the syntax is incorrect. In the review and validate section, tool lists the different access rules objects, NAT, interfaces and routes that will be migrated to the FMC. Once validation is complete, begin with the push. Upon completion, the tool provides a summary of the different components that were migrated and also provides a detailed post-migration report which also contains the summary as well as the features that were enabled for migration, the mapping between the source and the target firewalls, the mapping between the security zones. It lists all the objects which had a conflict and how it was handled. It will list the network and port objects which were not referenced in any policy and hence not migrated. It provides the list of the application mapping done by the tool. It also provides the configuration that are not supported or are partially supported on the FTD. We can log into the firewall management center and review that the access policies that are created and the rules that have been created are as per the report. We can verify the interfaces and the objects and once satisfied we can go ahead with the deployment.